Thank you. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Court's channel. Court here. Let's do Pisces. Now into the fourth. Um, I'm going to do a new spread. I've been thinking about it. I know you guys, I know my, I'm still going to use my sexual magic, my tarot, okay? Uh, um, very explicit too. But I'm actually going to do it a different way for two nights now. Um, I don't know. I've just been feeling it. So I, I want to use different cards too. You know how I feel about my raw loves. They're raw. They're passionate. Okay. So I'm just going to see if this works this week for this, you know, my 12 zodi zodiacs for my raw love um, and, and use these cards and, and see if I can get out, of, get out of what I need to get out of the way I would with that. If that makes any sense. Forget it. Forget it. If this doesn't work, people aren't liking it, then then so be it. I'll go back to just using these. But um, I want to use these because they have different meanings too, just like those do, than the normal tarot, traditional tarot. And I want people to get new perspectives with how I read. Um, that's the whole reason why you're on my channel, to look at things differently. So we're going to do that, all right? Um, I will say, never again will I do 12 videos. Um, I mean, a video on 12 zodiacs and that was foolish of me because it was like I activated 12 decks at one time because I didn't want to cleanse in between so I was like oh I'm just gonna do one video and whew, hello you know we all we all learn as we go I learn as I go okay won't won't do that again that is for damn sure um that was a lot I don't think I fell asleep till like four in the morning so that was rough that was rough but it was fun but it was rough all right come on I just water, oh, I just watered you, so don't do that. Yeah, but I shouldn't have done that. That's cactus. That's cactus. I probably just got them all over my uh, cards. All right, so what do you got for my Pisces? Advice for my Pisces about the spread we're about to do. <clears throat> Can you feel the beat? Can you feel the beat within my heart? Hell yeah. With that beat in my heart. I got one even in, I got one even out. You know what? Why don't I just take the other one out? That's right. That's right. All right, my little Pisces. Happy birthday. Happy, happy, happy birthday to my Pisces. Make your fellas go. Your fellas go. Make your fellas go. Pisces, please. Now into the fourth raw love. Already. What's going on with my Pisces? Three of hats. I, let me just clarify. I always say three of hats is three of swords. Get used to it. Don't try to correct me. Because all my knaves are really knives. No, all my knives are really knaves, but I call them knives. Okay? And my three of swords, all the time, I say three of hats. It won't stop ever. All right? Go with it for my new subscribers that are like, she says three of hats. Yeah, court, yep, I do. All right? So this is right off the bat with these cards, okay? This is somebody who's afraid of getting that heart broken. And I'm not going to stand up with each one. What the heck? I'm in New England right now. My lights just flickered. Um, we got some heavy sleet, okay? But look at this picture up close. See that guy? He's this guy or woman, okay? But it's a guy in the, in the photo. He is scared shitless. Scared, scared, scared of getting the heart broken. All right. This isn't, this isn't that he got here, she got the heart stabbed. This is somebody who's scared shitless of putting, getting themselves into something that is possibly going to break the heart because of the past. Okay. That, that's what this card is. All right. That's what we're going with that. And now we have the, the six of swords. So he's scared, but feeling victorious at the same time. We'll see where we go with this. All right. Five of Swords. So this is a lose-lose situation. Like, he feels victorious. Give me a minute. 
because we're ass backwards. Somebody's all effed up right now. Somebody's all in their subconscious and these are coming out mm, backwards. They want a new start with somebody, but they're afraid. They're hesitating. All right. I think they feel they're not going to be victorious because they're all up in their head. I think they think it's a lose-lose situation to have a new start with somebody. I don't know why, but that's the scenario right now. We got the two of wands, okay? This person's looking out, not to mention he or she's holding the oyster in his hand, okay? So it's like you got desire, you got passion for, for, for one of these ideas, okay, that you have. So so go with the passion. Of course, always going to say with the two of wands, you know, when you're trying to make that decision, you know, if it feels right and it's the right kind of scenario, go go with passion, all right? Go with what, what it is that you love that you're going to be passionate about. Here's the five of swords. See, we got two people in the background and, and this, this is lose, lose. Five of swords out of the whole entire deck is my card. I, I freaking hate the five. Of, I'd rather see the tower over the five of swords. I ain't shitting you. It's a lose, lose. It's a costly victory. I don't, I don't freaking like this card. Anywho, ace of pence. That's a brand new start. Look at that huge opportunity that the universe is about to put in front of you. But you're like, mm, I don't know. Follow your passion. All right. And then you got the page of swords. So I don't know if you're dealing with an air sign or if, or if you're just dealing with this energy right now, because you're just, you're so undecisive and you're mentally like in your head, like this person wants a new stat, but is very, very uh, weary of this new stat. You know, this, yeah, this person that's probably an air sign wants to offer love. So now we got the page, the page of chalices. So I guarantee you're probably dealing with air. And he wants to come off uh, love to somebody. Contemplating love, okay? Because we contemplating, remember, this person's been hurt in the past. All right. This this person's worried about getting hurt in the future. But don't you know how court is about that? Take go after this passion. All right. You have a decision to make. Go after go after passion. All right. You're you're being way too logical about it. You're overthinking the scenario. Go off of what it is you want to offer somebody or vice versa. All right. Um, beautiful. We got temperance. All right. So we got the six of swords. And this six of swords is like it's moving away. It's distancing yourself from somebody because this person has their back turned towards you. All right. They're in the same boat as you. But you're distancing yourself. Or it's either that or you picked yourself up. And maybe you have a family you had to bring with you. I don't know, regardless, you're moving, you're moving away from it. Tempers is here to restore harmony again. Okay, so you're walking, you're probably getting yourself out of something that you had to distance yourself from. But but now, you know, the universe, Tempers is here saying, you know, I want to restore harmony. And not to mention the op look how big this opportunity is that the universe is about to give to you. Okay, and it's like you're holding the oyster in your hand to try and decide, you know, do I want this? Do I not want this? Well, I, I do. Okay, all right. What else? That's too many. What else? For my singles, I feel like whatever it is you're going to go towards, you're going to be victorious in it, all right? You're dealing with it, with somebody, you, you know... I, if you're worried about having your heart broken and you're looking to go out and date, that's foolish. Please take care of yourself. If you've gotten to the point where you're okay, uh, if you've gotten to the point where, um, you know, you're getting over this, you're getting over the fear of, of that and because you want a new start, then you're going to have options and it's going to look good, okay? So move away from the worry because you're not going to be successful, and I will tell you, my little singles, um, the universe is bringing somebody to you or you're going to bump into somebody. This is somebody you, um, this is somebody who's meant to be in your life right now. Cause not only do we have harmony, we now have justice too and a magician. So those that are, whoever it is you're thinking about is your twin. Okay. Um, so it's decisions, decisions. All right. 
And I don't know if there's still two people in the picture or if you walked away from something, but this is comic too, all right? So my singles, you're going to be okay. The universe is bringing somebody to you. Your universe is bringing you your life partner or your twin or your soulmate. Everyone who thinks they just have a soulmate, everybody is a soulmate. Chances are you have a twin that you are very unaware of because you haven't met this person yet, all right? And you will. And you're, you'll know right off the bat once you get into something, you're going to be like, ah, oh, damn, that's what that is. Yeah, now you got the Hierophant. You're dealing this the these particular people, whoever this person's going to, is going towards their twin. If this is resonating with you, okay? Now we have strength. Damn. Major, 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 major. Arcana. Back to back. Five. Back to back. All right. You're going through. It's gonna be a big week for you. Yeah, you got options. You don't know which way to take. So if you're single, you got options too. I am telling you, if you're single, you got you got air and water to choose between all right um well there's more to more than that but that's probably what you're dealing with what where you're going with that you know your own water but um okay i know where we're going with this all right so This is somebody's twin coming at them or your twin going towards somebody and you know this person's your twin if you watch my videos, okay? Um, this is your scenario right now, all right? So you mentally, you just left somebody, all right? And you want to be victorious, all right? This is almost like my twin video the other day. I ain't shitting you. You're worried about being victorious because you left somebody or this person left you. It doesn't matter, all right? It doesn't matter how that went down. Regardless, you're worried. Looking, You're looking right at each other. You're fucking battling each other like nuts right now damn power went out no just went out in here oh maybe it's my light yeah it is <clears throat> i was gonna say why is my radio still going oh what what did you do move with number two i'm in love with number two see watch i'm about to break this down for you I can't sleep. I can't sleep. All right. See the light. See the light just went on. Wake up call. Now it's time for a wake up call. My little uh, fishies. Okay. Look at how much this person's battling themselves. Is it going to be victorious? Is it not? If I, I mean, I just walked, if I walk away from another, is this person going to walk away? Am I going to lose? I don't fucking know. All right. But go for it. Like you're victorious, but you're not. You, you, you feel like, you're so scared of getting your heart broken again that you're not willing to take the freaking risk to start your new future with your twin. Mother frigga. Why does that keep happening to me? What are you stuck on? Why is it even? I don't even understand. I'm plugging you in over here. No, I can't because you're attached to the wall. Oh. See, this is you. This is your brain. The light's on, the light's off. The light's on, the light's off. Oh, oh, the light went on again. Okay, now I'm feeling victorious. Oh, the light went off. Now I'm all up in my subconscious again. For real. Okay? That's how that is. So you're battling yourself. You're worried about being broken. How did you want a new start with this person? You, you got so much passion for this person. You, you're finally moving away from what doesn't serve you. Like, this, whatever this is, whoever you're going towards, you're going to your twin, obviously. Tempers is here to restore. All right, this is comic. This is justice. This is your twin. This is a magician. It's time to wipe the slate clean and have a commitment. Have strength to have this commitment. Okay, a magician and strength. All right, have strength to have this commitment to step into something new. You you got options? Yeah, you you're single now. You got options? Hell yeah, you got options. But you know what? Here's the nine of cups. You threw a freaking wish in the well a while ago. All right, this this right here, this new stat that the universe is giving you. See how big of a un the big of an opportunity the universe is giving you. You threw this wish in the well, probably a couple years ago. You've been waiting and seeking to have this, and it's here now. And it's here, and you're like you're just like I I I don't know, I I don't know, I don't know what to do. Okay, that's your fucking sin. Excuse me, that's your scenario, my little fishies. All right, I I'm not shitting you. Um, you're not, <sighs> I know what you guys were dealing with. So you finally moved away. You finally distanced yourself from what you needed to get yourself out of. Okay. And now there's options. Okay. And the option is to be single or to be with your twin or to go towards your twin. 
and I, you want to go towards your twin. And there's no, you want to go towards your twin, but you're so worried about a broken heart. You're so worried if you walk away from this other person, if this other person's going to turn their back on you. That's horrible. That's a horrible way to process this. Do you understand me? That's lousy. That's lousy because you're like, I can lose both. If you're teetering between two people, then you shouldn't be with either of them right this minute. That means get yourself out of the freaking scenario. Find you again. Find your self-worth. Find your self-love. And then make that decision on who to go towards. I don't like that. I don't like when people have two decisions to make like that because it's like, get out of both of them. You shouldn't, you shouldn't even have been in that scenario. So how are either of them a good choice if you don't get yourself out of the scenario first to find who you are again? That's just my opinion. Sorry. I ain't shitting you. That's how I feel about that. You know? So you are single now, and but you're still making a choice. Or or if you're not, I feel like you're single. I feel like you moved away from it. I ain't shitting you. That's the I feel like you moved away from the scenario. Okay? But now now one but now one's out of the picture, but you want to go to the other because you know it's probably a true love. So like I get that. If you had enough time to heal in between all this, then go for it, okay? But if you haven't, please don't, okay? Um, so, you know, you're, you're coming in. You're going you're gonna to talk to this person. You want to restore it. You know, you know it's karmic. You, you know what you're twin. You want to wipe the slate clean. You know, like this can be a life commitment, and you know that. this. But the, you've wished for this. You need strength to do it now. Stop, you know, you've been, stop with the options, okay? Like, there's too many cups here. You're confusing the shit out of yourself, all right? But you want your wish. You want this person. You want your twin. You want to go right towards it, but you're afraid um, because of all the shit that went down in the past between the two of you that you're not going to be able to um, find harmony again. And I'm telling you, you will. You have your twin twice. Look at the infinity twice. And this is your wish, okay? Like... And not to mention the universe. I I'm telling you, I can break this down. Here's temperance. Look how beautiful. She's going to restore, okay? This is, look how big that opportunity is that the universe has given you right now. This is something you've already wished for. And they're saying, here you go. You've worked so hard. You're learning your lessons. Here's your new opportunity, all right? Here it is if you want it with your twin, okay? Here's your twin. Look at infinity. Infinity with strength, okay? I, I, I ain't shitting you. You see the infinity between both of their heads, okay? And these are together, all right? Like, the thing that's in between them is the hierophant. Do I want this commitment? Do I not? Because you know exactly, you know exactly who this person is to you. And you're scared, which is all right. I'm not saying it, like, in a bad way. But you're, you're, you're a little scared. You're a little intimidated. I don't, I don't blame you. This is a huge opportunity that the universe is putting in front of you. And you want to make damn sure that you're making the right choice. The thing that I don't like about it is that... You're either about to step out of something to go to your twin, but I don't like that because you're worried if I step out of this one, I'm going to lose her or him. And then if I go to this one and we can't restore it, I'm going to lose her or him. And then you're going to find yourself there. Well, then maybe you should find yourself there because that's karma. All right. I don't know. Maybe that's me being an asshole, but that's the, that's the truth of it. Okay. You shouldn't have bet, put yourself in that scenario anyway. And if you're thinking about leaving the other person that you've invested time into, you shouldn't be with that other person anyway, because now you're contemplating whether or not you should be with this person. If you're contemplating whether or not, if you're choosing over whether to be with her anymore, then that's your decision. If you even have to contemplate whether or not you want to be with this person, you shouldn't be with this person. You understand what I'm saying? It should be that easy. I know it's not. But look at it that way, please. Because... If you're deciding between two people, you put yourself in a position you shouldn't have. But if you're thinking about leaving a relationship that you were in, and it's even an option, get out. Get out because you're not happy. It shouldn't be an option because if you were happy, it wouldn't even it wouldn't be an option. Nor would there be another person. So. You're worried about being heartbroken. You want victory, but you feel like you might not get it. You know the opportunity is there. You know, you're making a choice. Go with passion. That's my advice, okay? And now you have the king of swords. I mean, the, the knight of swords and the knight of uh, 
chalices and I think it's air coming out water, but you know, you're distancing yourself from either the water or that you, or this whole thing. You're just, you're moving away from all this because you want to restore, you want your twin, you want the commitment, you need strength. You do have options, but that also can be, you're confused because you know, this is your wish. You have a brand new stat with, with a wish, with a coin that you dropped in the well probably years ago. Okay. So don't contemplate whether or not you want to be with this other person, leave this other person for another one. Because if you're contemplating leaving somebody else for another person, that's a, that's a, that, that's your answer. Yeah. Get out of it. Get out of it. If it's even a decision, there's no passion there. There's no love. I'm, there's probably love, but get, if you're contemplating whether or not to be, to leave somebody, that's to me is where the love goes. Get out, get out. There's not happiness, and uh, look at those fell in between the uh, the two infinities. So I'm gonna I'm gonna leave those and see what those are. But um, get out, get out, and if you get the, get the fuck out, man, get out of it, get out of the icky. All right, you can be victorious. This, the the this is um this is divine. This is being put together. All right, this other person came into your life for a reason, so. If this other person is your, tw obviously is your twin and you're contemplating, do I, do I go to my, leave what is no good and go to my twin, but you're worried about a broken heart, don't be, all right? Because this is your twin, the universe divinely guided you to this person. This person was put into your path for a reason. And that's why your option is the two of wands, because that's fire, that's passion, all right? They're, they're trying to tell you to follow your passion. And the page of swords is all about communication. Go communicate your love. From the person that you probably distanced yourself from because ha, ten persons here to restore this magnificent beauty that you wished for, okay? Yeah, the four of wands, there's this stability. All right, look how beautiful. There's your stability. But you you already know that, okay? And now you got the Niva wands, and this is finding each other all over again, like going deep, deep within. I mean, this is these two cards are very intense. So now, so now on top of everything that we just talked about, the intensity between how you feel between you and your twin is like no other. And you know that, okay? So I don't know if it's a little intimidating and you're a little confused, but don't be. Don't be because court just broke that down for you. There's not much to clarify, all right? Because it's it's beautiful, all right? Um, the passion that the tool you share for each other is um, mutual, and it's it, it's freaking beautiful. This is confusion. Tell me about the Seven of Cups, please. You know, the universe is, is giving you a giant opportunity, all right? Yeah, the Ten of Pentacles. Stop, like... Or this is, you know, it's the Ten of Pence. But in this deck, this means, you know, like this is reciprocity between the two of you. You know, it's it's beautiful. Don't don't worry about confusion or opportunity. Don't worry about that because that's the Ten of Pence. That's completion. Like you're going from the Ace to the Ten because you've been in between all that bullshit in the past with your twin. There's been growth between the two of you. Tremendous amount of growth, okay? So it's going to be, it's it, there's such success on the board. And the only thing that's holding you back, this is just like, I'm not shitting you. Go watch. If you don't, if you think you don't have a twin, go watch the twin um, video that I just posted a couple days ago, because this is kind of, kind of the same. All right. It's just, um, this is, that's that scenario. Okay. And I'm probably going to read a lot of raw loves like that in the next two days, because everybody is walking out of something to walk into something because of all the, like the, the little updates I did. You know what I mean? So it is like that. I didn't even ask for anything. We got the seven of pence. Yeah, you're tired. All right. You're tired. Um with with your past with the ten of swords. It's time to lay it down. Here's your ace of chalices. Like have go off of that. Here's justice again. Go go off of that. All right. Um, let's read what these are. But I'm um, take the risk. Follow, follow, um, follow your hat, follow your passion, okay? Because it's it's beautiful. Got the fedling. Um, 
this is time for you to remember that you cannot know everything until you experience them. Being in this involving state means you may stumble a bit. Don't expect it to be perfect. Now is the time for your being to be gentle on yourself and step into your destiny before this beautiful person and be this beautiful person you're meant to be. When the fiddling appears, this is a sign of new growth and a wonderful new opportunity. Step forward to curiosity and willingness and learn and discover. Everything I just said. Everything I just said. Go. Go after your twin. Go get your twin. I could cry right now. The beauty. The Go get your freaking twin. This person is waiting for you to come home. That's what that's like. It's so intense. All this person wants to do is love you. Okay? There's been so much growth. Go home. And what I mean by go home is like, Go create your home. Like this, the two of you when you're together are so comfortable. It's the two of you together, no matter where you are, is home. That's what I'm saying. This is the, how powerful this this spread is. This spread is like go, go home. Go love each other. Go, go home. You guys have had multiple lives. Now, now you're coming into an opportunity to actually nail this. Go get your twin. Do you understand me? Go hug the shit out of your twin. This kind of spread makes me feel like... Be foolish. I, I, I go text your twin right now, whether whether you you're in this, whether or not you're still like processing to do this or not. Like, go text your twin and tell your twin I love you, and leave it at that if you need to. Okay, I, I'm not I'm not shitting you. Go embrace what the universe is giving you. <sighs> Differences. As your goddess, I have seen many since since the beginning of time. Now is the now is the time between different differences between all beings are scarce and good. You must learn to accept the others that are not the same as you. It's important for others to allow others to express their own opinions. Consider the difference between the orange and the apple. Both are fruit, but both are a different kinds. It is more valuable than the other. No, I don't think so. I think not. All creatures and all beings have the right to your uniqueness. Try to see and hear the other person's side if you can. I'm telling you right now. I might even be dealing with an Aries. But I will tell you, um, this is this is mutual. Don't worry about this other person not understanding. Go, go embrace your twin. If you're a twin that needs to go to your twin... Go take this opportunity that the universe is giving you, that you've wished for, that is now here because you went through so much karmic growth, probably with other people, but you've learned lessons. This is an older couple that has been through a lot. Um, you got, I can't even tell you how powerful this spread is, okay? You got the two infinities. You got the strength and the magician right in between the hierophant. Like, this is what the, what the universe is giving you. Is, is remarkable. I, it, it's it's like the fact that you would, I, I understand it's probably so intense, that's, that's why, and and, it, and it's worried about, you know, you're straight up worried about getting your heart broken or leaving, why, look at, look at, this is, um, this is like grand, like this is royalty, this is, I, I think you guys had some lives I way, way the F back when. I ain't shitting you. This is how long the two of you have been struggling to get to each other. And that's why I'm so powerful when I say to myself, go home. I don't know why I feel it like that. Like, this is heart wrenching. Heart wrenching. All right? I don't even know. I don't even know if my twin, all right? Because I'm not with mine. I don't even know my, my hope my twin has Pisces in him. Because I don't have Pisces in me. And this isn't like this. This is whatever this is. I can feel. I can feel the heartache. I can feel the love. 
whether this person expresses it to you or not, and you know who this person is, this person loves loves you so much. They don't even have to tell you how much they love you because you feel it. But it's your twin, so don't be foolish. You know this person, all right? You, you've been separated from this person for a while, and it's time. It's time to go home. It's time to embrace each other again. It's time for the, the two of your souls to reunite. That is the most beautiful reading. The way I feel that, I'm hoping my, I hope my twin has Pisces in him. Because that's how much I feel it. Okay? And I'm just saying it. Like, I'm feeling it for you guys, too. That's how powerful it was. That, um, that, that, that link. That the tool you share. And the only thing that's stopping you is a little bit, of, is, is fear. And, and possibly being in something that you have to get out of. But a lot of my, uh, all my Zodiacs, when I did my update, walked away. Okay? You Now you, that you walked away, um, and you gotta walk in. This is the thing. You know how court always says, take your time with certain things before you step in? Not this scenario. Not the love that I feel, not the love that I see. You don't wait on this. So if you have to go to a twin, you don't stop waiting on this. Stop. Go. Go get the love of your life. The love of your life. I love you guys. I'm so happy for my fishies. I'm so happy for you. Bye, guys.